Now to a Delta flight diverted after the airline says a passenger tried to break into the cockpit. ABC's Elwin Lopez has the story. Overnight, witnesses on this Delta flight capturing the terrifying moment a passenger allegedly trying to break into the plane's cockpit mid-flight. Yeah, there's still a struggle going on. Uh, he is restrained now, Delta 386. This video showing passengers and crew holding him down. We're going to have to get him back. Overnight, ABC News speaking with some of the passengers on the flight who jumped into action. And my wife said, quick, look. The, um, the flight attendant's fighting with someone, and um, apparently he was trying to get into the cockpit, so I dove out of my seat and helped wrestle the guy. The man shoeless and restrained with zip ties before he was finally picked up and taken to the back of the plane. And we both had his hands. I had zip tie. Yeah, and then some people brought the zip ties, one of the other flight attendants, and we all had his hands, and the flight attendant kind of it took a while to get his hands behind his back. The flight taking off from Los Angeles LAX, heading to Nashville, but diverted to Albuquerque. Delta Airlines saying in a statement, the aircraft safely landed without incident, and the passenger was removed by law enforcement. This morning, the FBI also investigating. It could have been a lot worse, but uh, I'm just very happy. We had a lot of people on this plane that were willing to step up and, you know, do the right thing. Passengers we spoke to are now calling the flight attendant in that video a hero today. Those passengers finally making it to their destination more than six hours after originally scheduled. What? All right, Elwin, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.